All right. Do we want to watch our game back? Where was it? Let's go. Let's I think we lost both pistols. This was so unfortunate because Nitro didn't realize that the bomb was planted up top, so he respoke the ground, thinking it was planted in the normal spot on the ground. If we smoked up top, I think we win that pistol. I think I was scared of mid here. And we, I feel like the rotation was, to me, was like, I feel like I was engaged in this fight for the longest time. I didn't know where my teammates were. Because I was like, I didn't look at the minimap, but I feel like, so if we go back, so I, I peeked out and I give them a little bit of pressure at B. And we got this kill here, but we're on 4 and A at a minute 30. And I'm my turret's been killed since minute twenty-five. Over and over again, you, it's a good momentum. And I die at a minute, right? Bonus for them. I remember thinking to myself, like, what's going on right now? Like, I feel like we should killing them, rotating or something. I was sad. Oops, I pressed pause by accident. The spike carrier, time to come in, put the wall up, drop the spike, and now it's unlucky. If he had lost that duel versus steel, this would have been a totally different round. Right? Yeah, if I if I had a one dig, I think the round would be completely different. They worked so slow into this round that it was just sad. Why do you buy a sheriff in rounds? You don't win pistol and pistol rounds. If I'm playing Killjoy, I get it because I think Killjoy's best part of her kit is her turret. Five, 10, 15 seconds, the wall goes Whereas I wouldn't get it if I'm playing like Cypher, because I don't think Cypher's camera is the best part of his kit. I think Cypher's trips and cages are the best part of his kit. Right away, five players coming up, man box. Oh! This is what happened! For free, make it two. Boy and Android both fall, but he's still. What? There's a fall there! <laughs> he would have made it out if there was no wall there. He actually lives. Disaster striking for Anbox. I'm not quite sure what the plan was. I think they were gonna wall and. Oh my god, dude! They didn't have any players over towards Long B. This is what's happening in the games I'm playing. Look where I am when this is happening, right? Five players coming up man box at While this is happening, you have to realize, yeah? I'm on A just holding a line here, okay? I did not know this happened, okay? Why do you have no armor? Oh, he didn't buy armor. <laughs> Bro, you cannot make that up. He forgot to buy armor. He does this, he gets two. And if he, this wall wasn't here, he actually lives. Oh my god, dude. How is this possible? That is hilarious. Holy shit. I'm actually crying if I'm in box. The problem with the tactical pause is you're only allowed one per either half or game. And you have to call it by 15 seconds left in the, in the buy phase. Before we knew this rule, we are playing a game on like Haven or something. And we were running low on time, calling calling the play or late to our spots or whatever. So we we use our tack pause. And basically, the tack pause is you go, you press escape, you go to the cheats menu, and you click pause on, right? And then you just type in the lobby tack. The admins didn't like that. They said if you're going to do a tack pause, you need to do it by 15 seconds left. So if it's like 14 seconds left in freeze time, and you realize you're too late. Um, that you're going to be late to your spot, you can't call it attack pause then. You know, in CS you could. You could have one second left and type dot tack or something like that, or dot pause or whatever, or call timeout. As long as it's done before the freeze time's up, it works. It goes through. Why would that be a problem? I don't know. I didn't make the rule up. You can even see on the minimap Aldrone being. What is this? Why are you knife out? 
seven. Hey, look, so let's do it again. Android basically takes a solo duel with some solo. No comms? But, you know, even just spreading them out <laughs> a little bit from Anbox, right away, 100 Thieves is coming back. I gotta call Kitchen of Salt to unlucky, really. Also has that Blade Storm in his pocket. 100 Thieves down to three members left in a 3v5. You can maybe take a chance at this, but this is not easy. Yeah, this is a tough spot for 100 Thieves and... Yeah, this is unwinnable. I think what happened here was really good, though. So I popped my ulti, and it's like, it's way too late to win this round. The fact that they blew their Sova ult, and then, so watch this right now. Watch watch on, on the radar up here, you see? They're all basically leaving because my Killjoy ult's about to go off, and Nitro gets here to start defusing, and I guess they didn't realize that it wasn't halved or something. The bomb's like literally three seconds from blowing up. Look at where they are and follow them on the minimap here. One, two, three. lose one or two players to the spike. No way. Do you need three people? So well played. I mean, just even tapping the spike there makes them so paranoid of it. I mean, sure, there's three more rounds in the half, but like. Nitro with the 300 IQ. It means that, you know, because they're on no round loss, if they lose this round, 2,900, this guy's at like 2,400, this guy's at like 2,800, this guy's at like, you know, 4,400. That's pretty costly. And they use their Sovalti. And they use the Jet Knives that round. And they res that round as well. That was an expensive round. My jet is hiding in sight with a frenzy. Quan, what do you have to say for yourself? They're gonna start to funnel here onto this B site. The wall's gonna go up. Austin is sitting on the other side, <laughs> along with Dicey. Android able to take care of Austin early on as he's playing his way around yellow. <laughs> Wait, how did, the, the, did you just die? Um, the map as he's working, he's top? In the middle of the map, it seems like. Wait, so this isn't your round then, or? He's Wait, no did you whiff or something? I think I just come and stick the bomb or something, yeah? If I'm in your position, I miss all those shots because none of them are looking at me. This gun reloads so fast. I feel like they need to do what they did in CS, where they made the CZ like pull out time and like reload time. They just nerfed it to the hell, basically. I think this in general is a vandal map. All the one tap angles. Oh, this round was sad. Wait, no, sorry. I was thinking another round where we ran into four of them. This was still kind of sad though. Not um, quite committed yet. Well, and that's where the fact that we didn't have. Um, so I want to see this. E. Austin are not able to connect on that, but Dicey does. As both teams have dropped one. Yay. Trying to get one with the. Oh, uh, there's something about like these nades. Able to get the second. Nitro thought he was going to die from them 100%, but that. Yeah, uh, I remember this. Okay. I, I'm, I'm up at belt. I don't see anything that's going on. I'm literally up here waiting for someone to peek into me. And I had zero clean shots the entire time. I like literally didn't see a single human. That's cool. My shot. That was kind of sad. You gotta come up with an eco round win here, where a force by round win, whatever you want to call it. I feel like losing pistol doesn't mean that much because you can just as easily win round two. You know, this this yields a little bit more than it did the last time round. Why'd I buy a sheriff? Because I'm sitting up top sniping them. I can one shot them across the map. And they can't one shot me. Unless they have a sheriff as well. Yeah, these guys got fucked on by this. side of the map, you've got seven rounds minimum to come up with. You lose pistol. Wait. Why did he rotate? He was just here. What's he holding? He's holding for us to go under the tube and lurk out this way, I guess. But then Raze is going to pick it up and he's going to rotate to A because mid's open. They're afraid of mid instead. Was it the drone that pulled them off? 
laid out the wall. They worked their way that really the kitchen. And, wow. Oh, no. Oh, boy, was there. But he, they just had no kitchen control, right? He was eight. <laughs> <laughs> they, don't even, they don't even stop. They don't even stop. Look. Look at my teammates with stingers. They don't even stop. kitchen control, right? <laughs> they don't even stop. The force up from 100 Thieves seems to be paying off for the time being. But Rebo gets... This... This is how not even close this game was, okay? I have two teammates with stingers and they don't even stop moving. The enemies still on specters. We're playing against people that are on specters and watch the shot Rebo's about to do. He's shooting a wall. Time being. But Rebo gets one, he's gonna drop. Yay. Down to the sheriff, he's gonna swap it out. How is this map close? One v four here. They also know where he is. That's a big pick, though, from Ye. He gets one, but dedicated towards Ye. Um, we played these guys in a scrim on this map last week, and we did. We beat them a lot harder in that practice game. I think it was like a thirteen four win before, like before we played out all the rounds. Things look good as they now equal down to a 2v2. The spike is down, and it looks like Nitro is going to be able yeah, to... Yeah, wait. Now, the fact that he's able to get the spike here, because I remember I was on, I was over on the flank, and I'd, I'd killed a... Thieves still want to go here. Um, 6-8. Hang on. Let me pull up my POV. I think I can show you my POV on, on this, because it's like a... I think it's fine, because it's, it's a 2v2 or whatever. Under, under back sight. Under back sight. Tag them. Oh. Oh. Uh, I gotta, next, I think where the A and screens. Like, try, yeah. Oh, I think Dirt. I'm try to oh, oh, white heaven, white heaven. I'm behind one more. Oh, one more. Nice. Screens or boiler screens one? Screens. screens or boiler? Are you able to get back? I could try, yeah. These screens or boiler? I'm not sure which. I could try, yeah. I think boiler. These screens. I don't know. A and screens, I think. Omen unknown. I'm gonna flank him. Under two. Yep. Under two dead. Yeah, this got so scary. Holy shit. I had no idea this is what he was going through. He got tagged and he had to dash back. Android's able to hold the line, at least for now. But Dicey and Seal get in on it, as does Nitro. Things look good. His 49 health. He could have died right there before he got the spike. It looks like Nitro is gonna be able to reposition. I guess Omen misses the Vandal shot, or the Marshall shot, yeah? If he got put down there, it's round over. Yeah, room to work with, but not necessarily time to work with. We got so lucky, holy sh**. Sound was being trashed when he was there, the same sounded like he was out the other side of 410. Dude, that is so squeaky bum. Reposition himself, he gets all the way back around long B, and if he gets a free one here on a Nitro, that could mean a winnable 1v1. He's even gonna get- And I put myself into a nice one-on-one. So Doug, this 1v1 is underway. Or a nice 50-50. Uh, Enjoy utility, man. That just gives away so much. The turret was there first. You see nano swarms all over the place. You can't get within sniffing distance of that thing without getting lit up. Boy. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, the mollies come there, but Seal was wise. I wonder. I wonder if popping the molly there makes him like. Yeah, he didn't even budge when I popped the molly. The well, the early mollies, because the chances that he was gonna go all the way around the box and break the mollies was kind of low, and the mollies go through the box. So if he taps the bomb, I could pop pop the molly. But if you're asking why I popped it that early, is because because he hadn't tapped the bomb at that point, I felt like he was walking around. And if you if you activate an ability like a cipher cage or that or a camera or whatever then it usually catches people to like move their crosser away i don't think he saw the mollies like imagine i had popped the molly like a second earlier when he was still closer to the bomb it might have caused him to think that i had seen him next to the bomb and if i had seen him i had to be in a certain position they have their pick of the litter here well you asked me about it i didn't see him though i had no idea where he was so i have to guess but if I guess right, then it's like really good for me. They don't buy it. Ye is gonna press issue at mid, gets one. Oh, 
Oh, I heard about this round. He saw me. They know we're going A. I pop my ulti. He goes still on his drone. He just goes for the early kill here. Does it see me do this? If Seb lived there... If Seb lives here... Because he can watch he can watch the bomb from back here. Wait, yeah. He can watch the bomb from back here. The fact that he gave me this fight here and I got the kill when I got it... Was the difference between, like, instantly losing the round or not. Was he come? Yeah, he was kind of pissed. I don't know if I told him that I took my turret away because I was coming A with him and that Nitro was going mid lurk. Yeah. Why did he go have bomb? Because Nitro was lurking mid that round. And normally I lurk mid, but I got to kill at mid. So if they see me at A, they might not expect Nitro to be mid. Rip. Not just not just a save decision, but I need to get out of here and not get the tame decision, and he doesn't quite make it. Steel already on the hunt, trying to get these weapons out of the hands of the box if possible. Contact exchange there towards defender spawn, and you know you highlighted it, and I think it was Seb lacking a little bit of ooh. Boy, we'll get the better of steel, so we'll hang on to this phantom for now. But uh, yeah, the early decision, it, you know, to to not res, you know, you were touching on it. It's not as though that's, that's a good play or a bad play. I think they just lacked info towards B. Unsure of what yeah, I had no idea what that... Like, even when I did it, I had no idea what the ulti was going to get. I had no idea. I've literally never ultied from there in my life. I think this ult is worth. It's this late into a game. You're losing 8-9. to nine. It's going to equalize it at 9-9. Nine, nine. Just by securing the round. I think it's 100% worth it. If it's going to secure you a round, especially this late into a game, I think it's worth it. You can't wait for perfect opportunities to use your ultimates in this game. Like, if you always think about, like, wait, no, it's not the perfect time. I can't get this or that. I think it's really bad because you miss out on opportunities that it can help you secure a round or help you keep a person alive or help you just a little bit to get over that edge because you have five people with five different alts that sometimes it's better to use an alt at like an okay time than save it on that okay time where it could really help you and wait for a perfect opportunity that might not ever come. Like there's a really good chance that there would be no good opportunity for me to use my ulti and me using the ulti there. Like let's go back a little bit. They're going for it at this point. And they they could have like potentially even gone for res play here, especially if if they kill me. But right here, when I do this, there's no way this guy can come in, take the duel on me, and then get the res off. Not a fucking chance. No chance. Like, look how far back they have to go. If they were going to start this 2v4 retake at this point, they're starting it from their spawn, and there's 15 seconds already gone from the bomb already. Which means they have basically... Um, how, what's the spec duration? 40? They lost 15 of it. There's 25 seconds left. They need... By 18 seconds... They have 18 seconds to run and get to the bomb and start the defuse. Not just, not just a save... Is it 45? That's a long time, dude. 45 seconds spike? That's a long time. OSH Wolf, thank you for the donation. What is your opinion on a team tea bags and lose and win plastic cup called Major Lol W? So perhaps not the healthiest of vibes that the caster just Oh, he TP'd to he could have gone caught there. Holy. Again, this is this is why I like Icebox right here. Nitro has earned his place over here at Long B, and suddenly Anbox has to dedicate. Why do these guys use Spectres? Defending this beast put now in the previous. How do they not know? We saw that the singer, the Bucky, 
and the sheriff are all better weapons, and the frenzy are all better weapons than the specter. Dude, I ate the second shock dart as well. But watch this, anyways. Did they not show it? All right. 10 10. I stole your kill. Spoiler dead. Shit on. I, I'm gonna live. Yeah. Shit on. Better. They know. Okay, it's just a sova over here. Like, let's go shoot this guy. I didn't even three two one or anything. I was that confident. I was that pissed and that confident. I had fifty three health, and I'm like, F this guy double shocked me. I was pissed. No one double shocks me like this. And if they don't, oh, dude, oh, they have a decent idea of bro, I was peeing my pants on that. Hang on, hang on. I actually almost peed my my pants when this happened, because I almost had a deja vu too. I'm walk flanking the rotators. One more going heaven. Just one HP, dead. Oh my god, dude! I clenched my balls, my ass, my tight butthole. This is three or four rounds. That's an e round right there. Holy, that got sketchy. Clenched balls, yeah, I clenched them with my hand. I cupped them. I squeezed. I had to keep them nice and tight and safe. Dude. What is their setup right now? Are they like almost gambling that we're going to do an A hit because their money's bad or something? Like their only mid control is a Sova in the kitchen. They're gambling three towards A and their only B defender is Snowman. Look how much respect these guys are giving us. I wanted us to plant the bomb, and then I was going to pop my Killjoy LT post plant. This round got super sketch, sketch, peen. I can say that word. To rotate over. They still have left two members further up over by A. Boy's going to take the scenic route back as Ye starts to push forward again. The Hunter Shiri is going to be used from Hiko. Tags up one. Oh, he gets the second. Not able to get the third shot to get the kill, but Steel takes care of Ye. Ye was the one on the flank. Rebo takes care of one. Asuna trades oh. out. There. Dude, this guy's pissed. I need you guys to see the angle I was holding this round. Look at this angle that I'm holding for this guy. Ready for it? <laughs> Look at the angle I'm holding for this guy. Right, pushing members back, but the loss <laughs> the difference maker. As they still haven't fired that off, the spike still hasn't been planned yet. It's just sitting harmlessly in the middle of the site. And box have a they have such a tight crack. They don't have the numbers advantage, but they do have a position. They managed to get the spike up, however. Andrew Bro, to keep them back. I b hopped my way in to get that spike. On the flank in a 3v1 to try to keep the map alive, to try to keep the tournament alive, but he's gonna drop. Ladies and gentlemen, your former kings of North America. Android could have stopped playing with needs there. <laughs>